NHL. It's a very painful reminder that life is short. You have to really take advantage of everything in the now and just maximize every opportunity that you possibly have. So I, I, be, I believe it's a reminder that life is precious and enjoy and try to maximize your time while we're all healthy and alive. I mean, that, that's what this is. And then at the same time, you know, find, you know, yeah, find better treatments for, for breast cancer because it's such a heterogeneous disease where there's receptor positive, receptor negative, different kind of, not to get too technical, but there's so many different kinds of breast cancer. My wife had a very rare form of breast cancer and she had no family history of it. So it's really bringing awareness to all different types of cancer in general. And I, I think that, and, and to have detection and guidelines that suited not just for one type of cancer, but all types. Yep. Right. Um, well, we know that alcohol is a factor in breast cancer, <clears throat> so either um, getting it or having recurrence. So my doctors have recommended three to five glasses of alcohol per week, which is like, okay, that's not a lot. But he said, you can do them all on one day if you want to. <laughs> I'm like, okay, good to know. Save it for vacation. Um, and then exercise. We know exercise is so important, not just for breast cancer, but for across the board for your health, general health. So uh, exercise, even if it's just 30 minutes a day, get out there, do something, and diet, and much less red meat. Um, my whole family is, uh, my sister who's here with me tonight is a breast cancer survivor, my mother, my grandmother, um, and the list goes on. So many, many people very close to me have suffered um, from cancer. One of my closest girlfriends right now is fighting it. So 